With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, today we have a question. The question is we are given x2 power a y3 power b and is equal to e power 5m and we are given that x power 3c into y power 4d is equal to e power 2n and we are given delta 1 delta 2 delta 3 as determinant of matrices now we have to find the values of x and y respectively let us see what we have here here on the first side we have x power a and y power b yes let us take this as x power a into y power b is equal to e power 5m yes this is our x power 2a and y power 3b now here that means here if we take logarithm on both sides taking logarithm on both sides what do we get if we take log on log on both sides we get logarithm of log e to the power x power 2a into y power 3b is equal to log to the base e of e power 5m yes now let us simplify this here what do we get if we do this equation we get here log to the base e yes 2a log to the base e into x plus 3b log to the e to the base y is equal to we get this as what do we get here we get this as 5m yes e power e which gets cancelled we get this as 5m yes similarly in the next equation if we take here if we take what do we have here x power 3c y power 4d yes x power 3c y power 4d what is it given as x power 3c y power 4d is given as e power 2n yes that means if we here also if we take log on both sides what do we get we get it as logarithm of x power 3c into y power 4d is equal to log to the base e of e power 2n yes that means here what do we get we get 3c into log e to the base x now plus 4d into log e, log y to the base e is equal to 2n yes this is our equation now let us see if we solve what now let us do this here in our determinant equations what do we get our log x to be yes therefore here what do we have we got this delta 1 is equal to 5m the, what is our delta 1 value let us write it here our delta 1 is equal to 5m 3b 2n and 4d yes and what is our delta 2 delta 2 is equal to 2a 5m 3c and 2n Yes, this is our delta 2 and what is our delta 3 delta 3 is given as 2a 3d yes 2a 3b 2a 3b and then what is it it is 3c and 4d this is our delta 3 before further solving into this question let us see what is Kramer's rule what is Kramer's rule here in matrices Kramer's rule is nothing but according to this if we have a matrix and determinant with respect to x coordinate is dx by d and what is y y equal to dy by capital D here capital D is the determinant of the whole matrix that means in our system according to Kramer's rule let us take this equation which is here this as our first equation and this as our second equation and applying first and second applying Kramer's rule on Kramer's rule on first x and y this is our matrix 2 by 2 matrix and this is our 2 by 2 matrix yes or no yes with respect to x y x y and m and n what do we get according to Kramer's rule solving 1 and 2 here our this is 2a yes or no that means here we get log of x log of x is nothing but our according to our x yes according to Kramer's rule this is x what do we get this to be this is equal to 5m and we get 3b and what is this 2n 
and what is it 4d yes 4d and which is nothing but determinant completely divided by what do we get here we get this as 2a 3b and then we get it as 3c and 4d yes this is our log x value which is nothing but how is this written as what is our delta 1 delta 1 is 5m 3b 2n and 4d yes this is nothing but delta 1 by delta 3 now let us see what our log y is applying Cramer's rule what do we get our here here log y is nothing but if we do log y here we get this log y to be 2a and then 5m and what is it this is nothing but 3c and then 2n now what is our denominator our denominator is 2a 3b 3c and 4d yes that means this is nothing but this is similar to delta 2 by delta 3 yes or no this is our delta 2 now therefore what do we what did we get here we got log to the base e of x is equal to delta 1 by delta 3 this implies x is equal to e power delta 1 by delta 3 now what is what do we have for y log e to the power base y equal to delta 2 by delta 3 which implies we get y is equal to e to the power of delta 2 by delta 3 yes these are our values of x and y what options does this satisfy here we have option 4 e x is equal to delta 1 by delta 3 and y is equal to e power delta 2 by delta 3 this is our answer option d thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today